But first, we want to start out in Kalamazoo. That's where flooding is setting records and creating headaches. Also, that flooding possibly related to a body found earlier today. At 24 Hour News 8, Zach Horner has the story for us tonight. The historic floods making it difficult to pass through some of these areas downtown and also making some of the roadways unsafe. A lot of roads still blocked off due to water in the roadways. And earlier today, we learned a man was found dead in these floodwaters. New information from Kalamazoo Department of Public Safety regarding a man found dead floating in floodwaters here in Kalamazoo. His car found near his body submerged in water, one of two vehicles found near the 500 block of Riverview Drive. Officials say citizens found the body around 11 a.m. and called police. Reports say it was obvious the man was dead when police arrived. We don't have the man's identity or the official cause of death as police say they are early on in the investigation. The flood has caused problems throughout the city, surprising even long-term residents. I was. I was shocked. I couldn't believe that it came up this far in all the years and the 30 years I lived here. I've never seen it come this far. The Bidock has always been flooded. Roads still blocked off throughout the city, making it hard to navigate downtown. Traveling for about 15, 20 minutes just trying to make it downtown on Michigan Avenue. Going from block to block and every block that I turn down, there's water everywhere. Officials say that the river crested at nearly 12 feet. Nine feet is flood stage. As Kalamazoo cleans up, more to be revealed in the coming days with regard to the man who lost his life found floating in these floodwaters. Officials are saying that the floodwaters are receding quicker than what they expected, and they'll be out here opening roads and removing debris to get things back to normal as soon as they can. And some of the areas that were affected by these floodwaters, they tested for contamination, and so far, nothing was found. In Kalamazoo, I'm Zach Horner, 24-Hour News 8.